This snack idea is fishing for compliments today on Weekend at the Cottage. Welcome to Weekend at the Cottage. I'm Nick Manoilovich. Today it's about one of my most popular dips, something my friends love each time I serve it. I'm going to show you how to make a smoked trout dip. The flavors are sensational. I'm going to suggest you check out the full recipe and story and tips on our dedicated website, Weekend at the Cottage. You might want to watch this video again and again on our dedicated YouTube channel. Subscribe to our channel when you're there. And then finally, find us on your favorite social media platforms like Pinterest, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The flavor of this smoked trout dip is so sensational, plus you're going to find tons of ways to enjoy it afternoon snack before a party serve it as a little hors d'oeuvre for a get together it's really amazing let me show you how to make it we're going to start by taking one fillet of smoked trout unlike smoked salmon smoked trout comes with the skin still attached so we're carefully going to remove the flesh to one side we discard the skin i like to do this recipe using a small food processor i'm placing the trout in there first now i'm going to add one chopped shallot Next two ingredients give this dip its dippiness. <laughs> I have a quarter cup of sour cream, quarter cup of mayonnaise. Do not skip the addition of one tablespoon of prepared horseradish. It is phenomenal in this recipe. I'm adding about a quarter cup of fresh dill. Just jam it in there. The juice from half a lemon gives this dip some zing. Lid goes on the food processor, do not run with it. Instead, we're just gonna pulse, pulse, pulse. We're trying to finely chop that trout, mix up those shallots and dill. We don't want it pureed though, you want it nice and chunky. When you think you're at that perfect consistency, lid comes off, look down. If need be, you're gonna move things around just to make sure everything is chopped. You can taste it at this point. Uh, in the recipe, I'm suggesting you can season with salt and pepper. I never do. I think this is bang on just the way it is. If you need to, lid back on, pulse, 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 and now you're ready to transfer this smoked trout dip into a attractive little presentation piece. Do a garnish with some sliced lemon and a bit of dill. I love serving this dip with crackers, assorted vegetables for a relaxed get together. If you want to get all fancy, you can grab some toast points, add a dollop of the smoked trout, and then a little bit of lemon and a sprig of dill. Look at how cute and adorable that party snack is. Ooh, you're going to find out when you make this at home, smoked trout dip for everyone, I say. Until next time, enjoy. We'll see you again. Hmm, perfect. Mmm, snacky.